Hi, welcome to Nine Studio. If you like our channel, please subscribe to us. Today I'll be showing how to create van block for facade. First of all, you have to find the van block that you wanted to model. So you can see from here the size of the van block. The first thing you have to do is go to the home page of your Revit. Then you click for new families. Select metric curtain wall panel. Open it. Now you are going to create a new curtain wall panel family. So we come into this page which is a common setup page for curtain wall family. We go to the board plan. Then we create two reference plans based on the thickness of the van block that we saw earlier. Make sure both the lines are equal to the center line because um, you don't want your van block to be moving around. Create a new parameter for it because uh, it's a new file so you don't have any parameter inside. Now you can adjust the dimension. Once the reference plan has set, we create a solution in plan. Make sure to align all the edges to the reference planes in the drawings. Okay, now we look at the elevation. We have to set the height for the van block too. Align your edges to the reference line. Then we also set the width of the van block. Okay, now we finally get in the square shape as per the ramp block that we chosen earlier. We go back to the elevation, create a new reference plan at the middle of the ramp block. and create more reference plans based on the van block design. Always making sure that the dimension are equal if the van block is equal. Use a calculator to assist you if you don't know how much you will need to key in for. Set dimension for all. This is actually a dumb way to do it, but it ensures that give you the shape and dimensions that you need and you want. Now that you have the line and the shape comes out, you can create a new void. Trace the void according to the shape that you have just drawn out. Same, ensure to align all the lines to the reference plane.
after you finish the void, you will be able to see it at the 3D. It will cut through the object that you just drawn earlier. Just adjust the void to cut thoroughly. Save as the new family. Load into the project that you need it. Go to find any of the new curtain wall. Click the properties. Change the curtain panel to this new curtain panel that we just created. Set the dimension, you don't want it to run too far. Now when you try to draw this curtain wall, you will automatically show it as a land block wall. The dimensions are all intact as to the setting and it looks just fine. If you try to adjust the dimension which is not the same as the one that you set in the RAM block family, you will automatically replace into default glass panel. This is not the smartest way of doing it, there are still many other methods, but this is definitely the easiest one. If you like our video, please thumb up and subscribe to us. Thank you for watching our video.